All right, today's the day. Uh, I go on my first backpacking trip solo, mostly. I've organized um, campsite at Bioorganic Farm, know the guys there, then staying with a friend in Balana, and then riding back home after that. So riding solo, camping with friends, packing everything I need on my race bike, because I don't have a cycle cross yet. All right, so I'll take you through what I got. We'll start at the back of the bike, see if I can get the good angles. So, what we've got here, we've got, this is a pillow I blow up. Uh, my emergency blanket is my blanket, because turns out you can't fit a lot on an aero frame. This is my tent, I'll show you guys the tent as I set it up. One thing, one pair of swimming undies pants, undies, boardies, towel, boxes to sleep in, swimming goggles, because that's necessity. This is a poncho in case it rains. So I'm well packed with one of each thing. Let's hope it's not too cold because I don't have any cold weather gear. Then into where the frame's gonna be in my middle bag here. Can't fit much in there. So what we got is my bike lock for when I'm swimming on the beach. Necessities in keeping my teeth shiny white. Um, the old duct tape, electrical tape to keep everything holding on in case I need it. I probably will. These are tent pegs for the tent, which is um, mum's, uh, she's letting me borrow it. She's a trail walking, hiking person, so she's got heaps of that stuff, so I'm borrowing that as I get into this bike packing adventures. Then for the tent, she uses her hiking poles, but they're bigger than my top tube on my frame. So dad went to Bunnings, got four meters of pipe for like four bucks, a couple joining spaces and some caps, all up for $10. For super lightweight, a little bit bulky, but pretty good tent things. We haven't tried it yet. <laughs> I'm gonna try it tonight when I set the tent up, when I'm down at the farm. So thanks dad for that innovation. Not an engineer, but a roofer, so it's close enough. Then we're going into this little uh, bag we've got on the top of my frame. It's gonna be up here next to that GoPro. So we've got my front bag that'll be on the handlebars here. Only a small one, so it's only gonna fit some extra food. So I've got four cliff bars and five gels a day. I'm doing, well today I'm only doing 50 Ks down to the farm. And then Saturday, it's about 150 from there into Ballina, bypassing through Nimbin. And then Sunday from Ballina back home is about 140 Ks, but we're going to Michaela's parents for dinner as a Christmas thing in Brisbane area. Cleveland-ish, I think. And that's 150 k's from home. So there's a chance I'm doing almost 300 k's. If that's the case, I'm gonna stop in home and refuel. So we could have a massive day Sunday. I'm gonna have a massive tailwind as well. So the first two days headwind, big tailwind to bring me home at the end. And that's about it. Time to put it on the bike. Alright, so the game's changed up a little bit. Um, I forgot to mention I'm putting my Jesus sandals on because I can't fit shoes on anything. So tents in here, all the clothes are in here. I actually don't need this thing because there's heaps more space in this one than I thought there would be. So I've got both my tubes, my chain. I've then also put my toothbrush, wash, lip balm, um, pawpaw cream, tire changes. Uh, what else is in here? Allen key set tent poles, tent pegs, tape. I think I can fit something else in there if I needed to, but I don't want to overload it because I don't want it hitting my legs. I've never done it before and I don't want to bang, bang, bang every time. Then at the top here, I realized I almost don't need it, but I do want this option for coming back if I do need the maps and I can just put my phone in there and watch the maps as I go. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna actually keep this on or not. It would be handy not, well obviously to have less as possible. And then in the front here, it looks so organized. 
Ready? So obviously, how good is this for Cliff products? So I'll take out the top row of Cliff bars, so that's day two. Check out this organization in this backpack. Look at that, so it's like these pocket things here. So day one gels, or day two gels, day three gels. A couple Cliff bars at the bottom. So much space, it's actually ridiculous. Um, then I've got this front pocket as well, where I can put my um, Garmin charger, I'll also put my phone charger, and I shouldn't need my Whoop charger. It should last for three days. Um, I'm almost, like, packed. And it's really cool. I needed less than what I thought I would. So, almost time to hit the road.